Welcome to Idle Games TV and we're going to check out Car Shop Tycoon over here. Now this is going to be an idle game where you're going to sell cars, obviously, right? Come on. So you're going to have different kind of types of cars that you're going to be able to sell to your customers, you're going to do a lot of upgrades, earn a lot of gemstones and do a lot of upgrades with the gemstones as well. So you're going to have a parking lot over here. Different kind of customers will come, obviously they will check out your cars, you're going to need to sell them, you're going to be able to increase the price of the cars, but you're going to need to focus over here for the bank loans, because obviously not everyone has that high amount of cash to actually buy those cars. So they're going to need a credit, and as you can see over here, you're going to have a maximum number of credits, and in order for you to... Uh, let's say decrease your cooldown for that credit you're going to need to upgrade that as well so the loan renewal is going to need it to be upgraded quite quite fast here it is i don't have any more credit although i had some customers over there i will not be able to sell them those cars now, over here is going to be the test area for every map right now i'm at the fourth or the sixth map uh, this is a multiplier with um, 40 if i remember correctly the next one is going to be with 60 as you can see over here new and new zones uh, but you're going to need only to do what you're going to need only to sell the cars so you're going to need a specific amount of number of sales in order for you to move for the next map and honestly you can do that just by leaving your phone on you don't need to do that high amount of upgrades so this is going to be also a trick that you can use in order for you to move to the next map to the next map because if you're going to leave your phone on, obviously they're going to sell, but you will not sell cars offline. Although you will have offline earnings, the uh, number of cars will not increase. So in order for you to actually complete that number to move to the next map, you're going to need to stay in the game. Keep that in mind. Now over here you can see the tire on the top, on the bottom of the screen, my bad. You're going to be able to uh, bring in new and new brands. Now, you can see that the names are kind of similar so uh, something like Renault, something like BMW, something like Ferrari and something like Mercedes obviously you're going to need to look out for the statistics as well so number of brands as you can see over here the most profitable brand and different kind of other features that you definitely need to check out now don't forget don't forget that obviously you're going to have pop-up ads sorry for that so from every two minutes or so you're going to have some pop-up ads but not that long obviously some short pop-up ads you're going to have vending machines click on those vending machines because you're going to need to complete some quests over here now if you're going to complete those quests you're going to get a lot a lot of gems with those gems you're going to do some upgrades over here in the permanent upgrades now these keep in mind are permanent so obviously you're going to be able to move with these features to the next map to the next map and to the next map and obviously they will apply so you will need to increase your storage income increase our revenues in the soy in the store permanently uh, that's going to be a thing that you're going to obviously need even your reputation advertising in order for you to have more and more customers now don't focus on the advertising that much because uh, you will have enough customers and you will not be able to serve them that much due to the fact that you will not be able to lend okay you will not have bank loans that much so increase the process speed of store permanently that's going to be obviously a thing and the income as i mentioned i'm going to upgrade this one and that's it now over here in the test drive i do want to mention one thing every time you're going to upgrade the car care over there is going to increase the earnings every time you're going to test the car so you're going to earn some cash even when they're going to drive the car for a test and even when you're going to sell it but if you're going to increase the car speed it's going to take them less time to actually complete this track. So over here, they're going to test the car. Here it is. They're going to go. My bad, my bad. They're going to go and they're going to come over here with the car. Afterwards, next customer, next customer, and next customers. So you're going to have car care, car speed, but you're going to need to upgrade even the uh, queue line and obviously the track. You're going to want to upgrade the track because if you're going to upgrade the track you're going to be able to send two cars obviously afterwards three cars at one time so basically three customers uh, on that track one after another in order for you to actually satisfy more and more customers in order for you to obviously make more and more cash one more thing over here when you're going to be able to unlock new and new brands you're going to be able to actually hire some employees so basically some salespersons in order for them to actually complete some papers obviously sell 
uh, some of your cars you're going to have a variety that you're going to be able to upgrade sorry a pop-up pad now obviously the variety will bring you more and more cars over here as you can see i have five so if i'm going to go and upgrade over here right now i have the six cars so this is the newest one that i just brought over here so as long as you're going to have more and more cars more and more models obviously they will be more and more interested now you're going to need to upgrade even the variety because the variety will also increase the average earnings for that specific brand so you're going to need to upgrade that but also the training for your employee because you do want them to sell faster and faster so don't forget change the variety over here because the variety will obviously increase the earnings as i mentioned so those are things that you're going to need to watch out for and over here you're going to have the sales office now after they're going to talk with the sale persons obviously they're going to come and complete some papers in order for them to actually buy the car now you're going to have different kind of number of salesmen so i think up to five but you're going to need to also increase their speed over here as well but over here they're going to come only the guys that are going to buy with cash or already have the the money the the cash now you're going to have this internet order over here so basically this van will come from time to time and you're going to be able to watch an ad for cash or watch an ad for gems please watch at least the ads for gems because they're worth it that's how you're going to be able to earn more and more gems over here in the parking lot from time you're going to see a yellow gem click it is going to offer you one plus gemstone definitely you're going to need it don't forget to upgrade the parking lot as well uh, and also upgrade the advertising over here because you're going to need advertising for your parking lot but at least in my opinion the most important thing that you're going to want from here is going to be the bank loan so you're going to need to do upgrades over here quite a lot and you're going to need to leave your phone uh, with the game on uh, because that's how you're going to be able to reach that high number so 3000 sales is going to be really really high a number so you're going to need to wait a bit until you're going to be able to actually sell those numbers but in order for you to sell them even faster you're going to need to increase your maximum number of credits and obviously you're going to need to decrease the loan cooldown so please don't forget about that obviously a lot of ads that you're going to be able to watch uh, to have more customers sell really really fast and so on now you're going to have an option over here don't use it okay so the crystal exchange don't exchange sorry another pop-up ad so don't change your crystals over here okay uh, try not to do that here it is you can play this oh here it is three crystals not uh, one my bad so you can play this game also with your uh, internet connection off and you will not have those pop-up ads you will have uh probably two or three but afterwards the game will go without the pop-up ads so please keep that in mind you can just need you will need just to leave your phone on don't forget about the upgrades obviously you're going to have the possibility to put real money in the game uh, it's going to be up to you if you have played it any further let us know your tips your guides regarding this game an interesting game played similar games you can see them on my channel uh, drop some comments if you have to reach further as i mentioned and if you have better tips let us know in the comments below now guys if you have other idle games in mind drop some comments let us know their names obviously i'm trying to make more and more content regarding these idle features so a comment with different kind of idle games will be really, really appreciated don't forget to click on the vending machines i mentioned that earlier here it is you're going to have an ad with the ship ah i i missed that so this is an ad with the super speed basically you're going to be able to uh, work your employees as of maximum speed for 120 seconds but if you're not going to have the specific amount of numbers for the credit loans it will not work properly so don't bother with that ad at least okay the only ad that i would watch would be something to increase my income for the next two minutes uh, it's short i know obviously but it would have been better if they will increase that time so for example 10 minutes will be okay for at least one ad now don't forget over here just leave your phone on and try at least to unlock the next track now over here in order for me to unlock the next one is going to be really really expensive so i will not bother with waiting over here what i will try to do i will try to upgrade over here the car care and obviously the car speed in order for me to earn more and obviously decrease the amount of time that is necessary for them to actually do a test drive afterwards i'm going to be able to earn more and more and more and that's how i'm going to be able to do more and more upgrades guys don't forget to subscribe if you're not yet subscribed hit that like button don't forget over here on idle games tv you're going to find every day a new idle game let's hope that this was useful here it is you're going to see so 
if you probably saw it you're going to see but another pop-up pad watch this ad okay watch it over here when your customers will come you're going to see that they have a credit card on their head so the ones that do not go uh, do not uh, have the credit card on the heads when they're going to enter they're going to go to the bank the ones that have the credit card obviously they have the cash on them so those are the ones that are going to go straight over here so right now we need to focus on hiring a new salesman because a big big crowd over here so obviously i need more and more room in order for me to sell more and more cars guys until next time take care don't forget to subscribe smash that like button drop some comments with other idle games and be safe out there bye